All right, welcome back to our Varsity Sports High School Football Player of the Year special right here on Midco Sports tonight. All right, let's continue in South Dakota with Class 11B. Let's go through the contenders. The stats aren't going to jump off the page, but when you're done watching a Sioux Falls Christian game, most of the time you're convinced that Mitchell Goodberry was the best player on the field. Goodberry made more of a commitment to football after last season, and boy did it show. He was all over the field on both sides of the ball. He'll continue to play next season for Augustana. Mitchell's teammate, Parker Nelson, wasn't fully healthy all season long, but he finished the year super strong. He got the Joe Robbie MVP in the championship game, running for 245 yards and two touchdowns in the big game. For the season, almost 1,700 yards. That goes with this 2,000-yard season just a year ago. All right, the future Cyclone, Blake Peterson of Beersford, gets a spot on this list. Sometimes dominant defenders get overlooked, but it was hard to hide from Blake. He has had a tremendous career. Blake's scythe, length, athleticism, and just overall play on the field don't come around too often. His head coach, Scott Ebert, said he will go down as one of the best that I have ever had the privilege to work with in 23 years of coaching. We're in a better place here in Beersford for having Blake come through our football program. All right, let's talk about Caden Verley. He is a very unique player. He pretty much is the best player no matter where he lines up. He's been a receiver, running back, DB, kicker, punter, returner, anywhere. He literally does not come off the field. His head coach, Rich Lundstrom, says, I think he could play college football at eight different positions. Even with the storied history of Canton football, I truly believe that Caden will go down as one of the best football players to ever come out of the school. That's some high praise for this junior athlete. So another tough decision for me, it really came down to Caden Verley and Mitchell Goodberry. And the difference was demonstrated on the field. The first time Canton played Sioux Falls Christian, the Chargers were without Goodberry and Canton won. The second time they played Goodberry, he, uh, he held Verley in check and he was the best player on the field. In the championship game, Mitchell had a pick, a forced fumble, 14 tackles, a sack, and two touchdown receptions. Just shows how good this player is. He was the best in 11B for me.